Okay. Last week, we were talking about ways to describe motion in a scientific manner. And we talked about the terms distance, displacement, speed, and velocity. And one of the terms missing from that list was the term acceleration. So that's what we're talking about today. So the scientific way to describe acceleration is that as a object is as the ex, as an object accelerates its velocity is changing okay so acceleration is simply a change in velocity now think about this what is what is velocity well velocity includes two things it includes speed and it includes direction okay so when you're accelerating, you're either increasing in speed, you're increasing direction, or you're doing both, okay? Both apply to acceleration. So let's talk about speed first. All right, so consider you're riding a bike and you're going at a velocity of one meter per second south. And you're moving at a constant velocity for a while and then you start pedaling faster, okay? And as you start pedaling faster, you are accelerating at a speed of one meter per second every second, okay? That's where it becomes acceleration is when I talk about that second there. So, after two seconds, you're going two uh, meters per second south. After three seconds, you're going three meters per second south and after uh, five seconds, you're going five meters per second south. Yes, that is a form of acceleration, okay? Because you're talking about the velocity increase per second, or per a moment of time. So, your acceleration in this situation could be stated as an increase um, of one meter per second per second. And I'll put that up there. Um, to show you what that looks like, but that is what the acceleration of your bicycle would be in that scenario, okay? Now we also talked about um, how velocity means two things. It also means direction, change in direction. So this applies to acceleration as well. Um, an object can be accelerating if it changes direction. So say you're driving around a corner at a constant speed you're going 25 miles per hour around that corner are you accelerating i mean you're going at constant speed right well yes by definition you're actually accelerating even though you're going at a constant speed and why is that because you're changing direction okay so when an object undergoes acceleration its velocity changes, meaning that its speed can change or its direction can change. So in this given scenario, as the car is going around the corner at a constant speed, it's accelerating, even though its speed isn't changing. Pretty interesting, huh? That's all because of the definition of acceleration. Okay? So when you're going around a Ferris wheel, and the Ferris wheel is moving at a constant speed, you're actually accelerating even though the speed of this Ferris wheel isn't changing because you're changing direction. You're going up, you're going over, you're going down, you're changing direction. And by definition, that's acceleration. Okay? Even while you sit here on Earth, I'm sitting still right now, but the Earth is turning. I'm accelerating right now. Okay? So, uh, again, as an object undergoes acceleration, its velocity changes. And that is how you describe acceleration.